Hey everybody. Nice. Loading up our bale of silage. First bale here, two bales down the farm. A bit foggy this morning, but it's quite nice. It's going to be a good day. Let's see how he goes. Let's go, everybody. Yeah, we're ready to haul out. Hey, Mama. Yep. Already. And I'm hopping my tracks out where it's nice and warm. Ah, Morkas. They're going to be wanting a bigger break today. Give them a bigger break. Okay, let's go find some little garbage. We'll also go take our load up with two more bars of silage. Sweet. Got our two bales ready for tomorrow, and I've cut open the two bales directly in front of the tractor. Sweet, got a bale on the back. Let's go find some cows and feed out. Dad's already grabbed two of the calves. I can grab this little one. And then uh, we've got one to grab over there. Four heifers, little calves. Four heifer little calves. And uh, two mums so far. We've got two mums to go. Dad will follow her out. And I'll go start bringing the girls out. I definitely prefer that third bale. <laughs> nice bale, that last one I fed out. The second one was quite a rushy bale. First one was a bit drier. Cow number three. She knows the rules. She knows where she's going. One more to go. I think she's over here somewhere. There we are. Dad's got the last one heading out. Where? Had a good look through them. Could be a quiet day or two. <laughs> Hard to tell. Alright, put this reel back up, back fence them, then we'll head on up to go milk some cows and probably get a calf in from the heifers. Dad's just going to have a look at the cows, then we'll follow these girls up behind mum. So, yep, we'll get a move on. Come on, Grandma, oldest cow in the herd. She calved down, looks like she's bagged up well too. There we go, little heifers are going now. Got one cow carved, one heifer carved in here. The little calvey unfortunately had the bag over the face. So, um, deceased little calf, unfortunate. Poor girl, but we'll take her up and get her milked. Just putting the girls on their new break. All right, I'll walk this girl up. And Dad's gonna go make those fences alive. And uh, just have a quick check through those heifers again. We found an empty one, she's bullying today. She was bullying by trying to ride everyone else, so silly girl. <laughs> oh well, she'll taste nice that uh, bullying one that empty. All right, let's get up the front. Let's get to milking some cows. Back. Dad found a little carvey. <laughs> oh, hey, let's go find Mummy. Pretty sure it might be that 189 we were looking for last night. Found it. The hippo number 189. Just a black one. Can't really see her. A few black and white ones there. She's a good little mummy. Ready walked out. Easy. Another easy one. Six Turn today. Pick up the little dead carvey another day. And yeah, uh, if you do that, I like it. Yo, it's one eighty nine little carvey. Little boy. He's a bobby. All right, let's get up front. Let's go milk. Uh, Girls and uh, Stad said, it's coffee collection day today, so we're gonna pick up all the calves that are out here. Yeah, quite a few little calves to pick up. We're gonna start putting them, we'll put these little ones in the pen. Tag two. Got a little taggy, hang got in there. Ah, oh, just start feeding them. Feed them tonight. Oh, yeah. Everyone get your drink. Yep. 
all that little copies tagged. Yep, I see. The night tag goes a certain way. On the inside of the ear is the, the big tag. The main reader tag is on the inside of the ear. And the back is just a little button tag. Because it makes it a lot easier to read the tags. Okay. Let's go find some more calves. Two down. Ah, uh, ten to go. <laughs> five down. Uh, there's still about five or six in the paddock here. All right, let's get these girls in the milk. They'll pick up all their little calves. Dad's getting stuck. This hasn't happened for a while. Go, mum. Push them. Push them, mum. Sit. Mum, faster. Push, keep going. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, right. Oh, ladies. That's all the little carvies. Caught and captured now. Right. Yeah, good idea. We'll go shift the fence. And we'll probably milk the cows. Two buckets of fresh broth. Yep. And we can try and feed them. Tonight. Tonight, yeah. Probably should start thinking about putting my wet weather wear, wear the gear on. Because, yeah, uh, I'm all covered in mud. But, Nanny, clean as. Right, let's go shift this fence. Smoking girls will get a good break today. Hopefully, they don't make too much of a mess in it. But yeah, there's one calf left out here somewhere. Somewhere. Smoking's going great. The first, those two have been milked. There's these three here to milk in the middle, and all the others have been milked, so. Awesome, and we are milking tonight. Twice a day milking, from now till the end. It's good, it'll be good. Now till the end of May. Yep. Who's that down there? Mama, hey mum. Just finishing off the meal. <laughs> and uh, we're just waiting for one to finish, and then we can go put the little carvings out there in the calf pen, because that's it. They're off, mums. And then we'll see you girls tonight for your milking. Back into twice a day, girls. <laughs> yep, and Daddy's ready. She's going to be back. He's here for the whole carving. And maybe more. Maybe more. Oh, yeah. She's back in there. Yep. Yeah, everybody's got their jobs. Mum's washing down the pit. I'm washing the plants. And Dad's going to go put the calves in the cup. One of our drums of acid. We're into our next one now. Let's go put the new one in. Mom, do this. And put that on. Alright, so put this little thing in here. So we turn it the correct way to loosen her off. Just like that. Too easy. Got our new drum all hooked up. Yoni. Perfect. Right, as Dad said, we need to get a bottle of uh, milk for a little carvey, one of them. So we'll wash it out and yeah, give it some milk. That's that drum rinsed out and clean. So we can uh, take the lid off and give us some, uh, some calf milk in it. Mum's just in there feeding the little coffee. Um, ah, need to be holding the calf. Ah. For a nice little tag. Tag one to identify who the little calf is. Number eight. And Nate, that you'll have for the rest of your life, hopefully, if you don't lose it. And Nate is a government requirement. Yep, it's a tracking Animal tag. tracking tag that does it for its whole life. Yep. And once he's in, that's it. If it falls out, we have to buy another one and code it up to the right calf and make sure it's the right one or cow. Sorry. And that's how we call them. Um, Send them to the sales, you've got to have that, or else it's a $400 fine per animal if they don't have that little white tag. Right in there, Mum. So what we do is when we go at night, we generally give the little carvies their blue tag, and then when we get them in the morning, we give them their white tag, because the white tag's more important. We don't want that to fall out. But blue but tag blue just tag. is a recognition to who the mother is. Yep, an identifier of who the little carvey is, and what a, and it's a much easier way of reading that than reading those little white ones. Awesome. Right, we are missing a calf. The little calf is still in the paddock with the mum, but we didn't notice that. She's sitting somewhere in the long grass. All good. 
Mum's feeding the little cubby. Doing a good job, Mum. With that, I'm going to see you both tonight. I'm going to shoot off and go do some shopping. And um, back for milking tonight and feed some little calvies. What, four o'clock? Four o'clock sounds good. All right, catch you all at four. Did a good job, Nanny. Ah, oh, yes, rescue mission. Hey there, rescue yeah. mission. Rescue the neighbour. That neighbour's gotten stuck feeding out, so we're coming in to pull him out. We got the, the 7615. How we doing? <laughs> a little bit stuck. You go off by the trough, maybe. Dad's no. no. just going down to feed out. Yeah. A little bit bugged. Not too bad. Could be worse. Damn, Pete. Terrible grass. Jesus. Sick of the fair way. Dad's just gonna go down and feed out for him. As tires are spinning. Sheepers are soft. Ah, oh, he'll be happy. Those cows will be happy. Big tractor. Big flotation. Very helpful. Oh, yes. Right now, I'll try and pull him out. See how he goes. Pretty far down. I just about got stuck. He's up. He's out of there. <laughs> Yodi, easy as that. There we are. He's out. And we're off back to go and milk some cows. And then check out. Um, Jeepers. Yeah, as you can see here, the neighbor's place is very wet. He's quite low compared to us. And this is a paddock he grazed a couple of days ago, by the look of it, a week ago. <laughs> and look at that, drains are full. Just so wet, poor bugger. So, yeah, he got them further along that way. And girls aren't liking not having their car, but gotta get used to it. Well, there's the other car. We're looking for. That's one of the rules, mates have gone. But all good. Back on the farm. Let's go and check the dry cows. Come back and look at the dry cows. Go through. And it looks through. He's going in there. No little car there. No, it probably will be by the morning. So, uh, see you girls in the morning. Happy. Haven't even finished some silage there. Still got some eating there. Good girls. Yes, they don't know how lucky they are. I'm only complaining like that. Yeah, that was young grass from last year. It's recovered. The far paddock there, yeah, our oh, uh, crop paddock. It'll be good. Nice and crappy. This will be recovered quite well. Yeah, over with a bag of grass seed. Cheap, cheap grass seed. Yeah, cheap grass seed. And give it a roll. It'll be mint, it's come up good. Alright, see you girls in the morning. Let's go check on the hens. Set up the reel for tomorrow, we did. Good. Well, arrow's in this spot. Nice big up there. Girls are, well, heifers are happy. Fence is shifted. 
Get on to Mokin and feed some little cowies. I don't care. <laughs> First night milking of the season. These girls have been milked. We're catching colostrum. And uh, just for those cows, those little carvings in the pens. We're not going to get much tonight, but we did get a bit this morning, so we'll see how we go. Most of those cows will be pretty full. Had a good drink this morning. Okay, we're going to put a cold rinse through with our new acid to follow. Those girls milked, they're off. Let's see how much they gave. This morning they gave nearly 100 litres. Tonight, probably about 50. Not too bad. Get the washing now up. It's just all washed up. Now we're gonna go feed some little calves. We'll try anyway. I doubt this little folly will here will drink, or any of the other older ones will drink. So, let's go see some little calves and get to feed them. Let's just try and bottle feed some of them. We'll give it an okay. attempt. Dad's got the bottle and the milk. We'll give these little calves a try. Anyone that oh, drinks, that we'll put them through next door. <laughs> anyone that doesn't, yeah, that we'll leave them in here. I doubt anyone's going to okay, drink. I oh, go, you usually don't drink on the stuff. first night. There you go. Bottle feeding a little carvey. This is what we call bottle feeding. We do have cafeterias when we start to get into it, where we can feed up to 16 at a time. But we'll feed one at a time for now. Just for today. One down. 16 to go. Sorry. Yeah, six, six, 16 to go. Somewhere around there. Yeah, she's getting a bit dark in here, Carl. Oh, well, one to go. Yep, Dad's turn. <laughs> she drinking? Yep. She's drinking away. We've got two that have had a good drink tonight that are hungry. And none of the rest are actually very hungry. With that, like... And subscribe. And we'll see you in the morning. Yeah. What are you saying? Hey. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah.